review time, mad cool D5050 round drum. Uh, in this video, I'll be showing you some footage of me shooting this thing at the range. I'll show you some footage of some things I found on the internet that were interesting. Um, <clears throat> I'll be giving my 300 round update review on it. And we'll go from there, see where it takes us. We'll look at the functions and everything on here. But um, let's get into this video first. And that's not what I'm about. So let's see if we can get a 50 round Magnum. Or in this case, 49. Wow. So that guy had a lot of trouble, man. He had at least four attempts trying to get that thing going. Let's load this thing and show you how we load it here. It has a charging handle. So you charge it down. Let me see. Like that. Get that in there. Load it like this. Not really difficult. Kind of difficult with gloves on, but charge it all the way down. You see it'll and it'll get uh, a little tough as you go, but you can charge it all the way. Whoop, let me see. There we go. That's like that guy. All right, so it has a uh, rounds remaining window in the back. Obviously, we only have a few rounds in there. So unload it. Now, when you shoot, lever down. I made a mistake, and I'll get to my review and show you a little footage. I had to lever up, uh, so that wasn't good. Made a mistake doing that, and I uh, had to pull the mag out, and a round fell out. But uh, so lever down. And you unload just one at a time. You don't grab the lever or anything. Let's see, yeah, we're getting going right here. So it's also a bolt hole action. So your action should be open, charged, your handle, and that's when you insert it. So uh, it's a little, little shaky getting it out. Yep. So this thing is plastic. Magpul claims more durable than steel and all that. It has steel inserts, internals inside. But um, yeah, man, it was a lot of fun at the range. Not to the 300 review, 300 round review. I actually did a little more. I did about 320. And um, I had a lot of fun with this thing. I didn't have any hiccups. It ran flawlessly. Um, that was about two times at the range. I mean, um, you can open this thing up and clean it. I haven't done that yet but it ran flawlessly. So like I said, I was worried when I looked at those videos because I ordered this thing, then start looking at videos and I seen a few that were a little bad, but uh, this thing was a ton of fun. So, you know, if you're on the fence about it, thinking about getting one, they've been out for a couple of years now. So I'm sure you probably researched, but uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. I add a binary trigger to one of those MP5s and I'll review that and run it with this. Um, hey, I hope you found it helpful. So I'm out of here. I'll be doing a ton of gun reviews. So subscribe, get locked in if you want to see more of that. All right, man.